just a mile away, over on Claim 14 at the Eroica. Back in the ice, the melting ice. Weeks into the ice season, owner Emily Rydell hasn't yet made a dime. Because of this hot water heater, couldn't mind. And uh, now we're just hoping it's thawed out and ready to go. On their last dive. <laughs> Ice and the hot water lines nearly cost crewman Tony Mann his life. Look, regular for us. Come on, baby. Go on. Go on. Already 50K in the hole for her dredge, Emily needs to start producing gold fast. And the next diver up. I'm going to do a dive today. Is the captain herself. I'm just ready to put it past me and get down there and work. And if something happens, it happens. To be perfectly honest, I'm still scared shitless by it. I had a couple of scary experiences, um, and, uh, and now this is kind of like a trigger for me. In her career as a diver, <laughs> crippling panic attacks have cost Emily respect. You're not a miner, and you're not an asset to his operation. And credibility. Be a gold miner, if you don't dive. And remember, me and Daryl's on the end of that hose, so if you get, keep your line clear, and then all you gotta do is give us a shot and you will pull your ass up. Just remember to breathe out on your way up. All right, 10 4. Leadership makes me happy. I like um, being in control of things, but if you were really to have the right to run a dredge, you should be a diver. It's not something I should have to rely on people for, it's something that I should, I should be able to do myself. She sounds good. She's willing to work. She needs to get her butt back in the water, and here we go. Given her dive history, I hope she just, if she can keep her anxiety down, she'll be just fine. Just give me a second to kind of figure it out. Close your eyes and breathe. Oh. Just 15 minutes into her dive. Yeah, you guys have to come up. Spoke too soon, D-Rail. Captain Emily Rydell has been spooked. Yeah, it's going to take a while for her to get her confidence back. It's a weird thing. It's like, I don't know if it's because I'm anxious or it's because it's actually getting harder to breathe. I feel like I'm a psychopath. Yeah, I think my, I think this bitch is actually freezing. Uh, I wouldn't risk it. If you think you're freezing up at all, trust me, it's not a fun feeling. Oh, 
you're not a miner and you're not an asset to his operation. That's pretty hard to be a gold miner and graduate if you don't die. throw rocks and if you know just keep your breathing down. I can get more comfortable actually. Uh -uh. There you go. anxiety about as far as diving goes, but uh, I think she's getting over it slowly but surely. More time in the water, more comfortable you're going to be in the water. So she's getting it back now. <laughs> One mile east of Nome Harbor at the Eroica. Ladder. That's the ladder. Roger that. Coming home. Emily surfaces after a second trouble-free dive. Officially, back in the saddle. Good job. You got your confidence back. We like it. I saw some gold. I was going to see some yeah. gold down there. Like down. Hell yeah. Nice. It was good. I went down, saw some gold, and uh, I feel a lot better in the water. Today, I think I conquered some of the demons. At first, it was I was definitely pretty shaky, but uh, once I just started focusing on moving material, I felt fine. It went well. Emily being able to get back down in the water today was a good thing. Take some of the uh, strain off of Tony and I and put more gold in the box. It's a win, win, win all the way around. Hey, so. I got good news. Massive picker. Look at it, it's so round and pretty. Yeah. Look at that. Look at it, it's like, it's perfectly round Ooh, almost. It's heavy too. Let's go around those how to hunt, brother. Ah. Sexy, sexy gold. 